All right, we have two different tweets here, and they're both <laughs> different reactions. Let's take a look at it. Mine, mine is one of them on the left, and I'm saying, and like why, and like don't. And on the right is just saying, I'm so excited. And of course, <laughs> we're talking about that snow. Some of us saw some snow today, Jess. Yeah, some of us saw snow today, and the rest of us, Clay, might see some snow before the week is over, believe it or not, even all the way to the coast. So get excited, get pumped up. All right. Let's talk about what's happening right now. Still some rain out there. Uh, we will have showers overnight tonight through very early tomorrow morning, but we should actually be able to see some sun once we get into the late morning or early afternoon hours for tomorrow. So if you're kind of sick of the gray day, it's going to be a little bit nicer tomorrow. I promise 43 right now in Portland. It's 39 in Paris, 41 in Lewis and Augusta is at 40. Bangor's at 42 in Millinock at 39. Didn't make it out of the 30s today in Millinock. Very, very chilly. So overnight tonight, you could see those rain showers move through. This is eight o'clock tomorrow morning. Temperatures not too bad, low to mid 40s. The rain showers move out and you can see we'll start to see some breaks of sunshine as we go into tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures are going to struggle to warm up. Most of us will stay in the upper 40s or lower 50s for the day tomorrow, but we should be able to see that sun for much of the afternoon tomorrow before some more clouds move in heading into the day on Wednesday. This is six o'clock tomorrow night. Again, you can see those clouds moving right back in. Then for the day on Wednesday, clouds increasing. We'll start in the upper 20s and lower 30s Wednesday at 8 a.m. And temperatures again struggling to warm up. You can see a mix of sun and clouds for the day uh, as we head into Wednesday afternoon. Our high temperatures back into the mid to upper 40s. And that's really about it for Wednesday. So temperatures, of course, way below normal for this time of year. Our normal high temperatures in the mid 50s. And again, some of us stay stuck in the mid 40s for Wednesday. But after that is when it gets a lot more interesting. So hang on on Thursday, mostly cloudy skies around. Temperatures won't be too bad. We should be able to make it into with the low to mid 50s. But on Friday, this is what happens. This is Friday night at eight. You can see, of course, what looks likely we could see some significant snowfall even all the way to the coast. Uh, so something to keep an eye on for sure. And that's what we'll be doing as we go through the rest of the week. No numbers yet. I know that's all anyone wants to know and I get it, uh, but we will see some snowfall for the day on Friday. The other thing we could see is the wind gusts and they could gust pretty high. You don't want heavy wet snow mixed with wind. Of course, we're keeping an eye on Hurricane Zeta too. It's actually the remnants of Zeta that will bring us uh, the moisture to be able to get that snowfall for Friday. Seas tomorrow, two to three feet winds from the northwest, 10 to 15 knots gusting up to 25 knots. All right, so tomorrow not too bad. Temperatures right around 50. Then on Wednesday, after a very chilly start, we'll see a mix of sun and clouds. More clouds than sun, though. High temperatures in the mid 40s by Thursday. Clouds increasing. Not too bad for temperatures low to maybe some mid 50s. Then Thursday night into Friday, snow moves into the area right now. It's still looking likely Again, we have time for things to change, and it's a hurricane again that we're watching right now way down in the Gulf of Mexico. So plenty of time for things to change between now and Friday, but it's looking likely that at least somewhere in New England we'll see snow, and I think right now it's looking like it's going to be us. Then on Saturday, Halloween, temperatures will stay chilly only around 40. Don't forget, too, this weekend we actually turn the clocks back already. I forgot that we were already there. Second half of the weekend looks a little better, partly cloudy skies for the day on Sunday and closer to 50 clay. So here it is <laughs> snow a lot going on there. It's I, on the way. I yeah. don't think we need like a snow result or inches yet because no. I think this is just so jarring that it doesn't matter. Yeah, we'll it's like widespread snow. Yeah, give it to you bit by bit. Okay. Here. <laughs> Sounds good. Jess, thank you.